shit. Okay. We need to get him out of the way. Okay. Now. Uh, that's not scary at all. I need this body to move so I can block this. Come on, body. Before those guys break the hatch all the way. Come on, come on, come on. Get the hell out of here. Okay. Let's also, in case something's coming from that direction. Here, I need a little more room here. Let's also block this too. Okay, now we can make a stand. They will eventually break that. Um, I could, I would have made this very much easier on myself if I would not have tried to do it at night. Because <laughs> then we wouldn't be dealing with all these Nightwalker zombos. Ah, okay, well, whatever. More entertaining for you guys, right? So let's just wait. Uh, we've got a super monster out there, so we're probably just going to chuck a pipe bomb and blow the shit out of these guys once they get down here. Yeah, that's a lot of Zeeks. Let's not even mess with this. Didn't kill you, Nurse Nancy? These are tier two Nurse Nancy's. You're still not dead. Goodness. Come here. He's gonna bleed on you. Alright, so I guess our explosion killed the super monster. Because I'm not hearing it anymore. Their bodies don't stick around for more than a couple of seconds after you kill them anyways. Alright. Good enough. This is going to station one. Yeah, like I said, I, I could have made this a little bit easier on myself if we would have done this during the day, but all right, that's all right. All right, let's go down here. Something's probably going to spawn in on us. Uh, let's get the axe down here. I'm going to dump a couple of things. We don't need that or that or that or that or that. Um, I don't, I'm not even going to keep the bone fragments. We got, I've got over a full stack of bones at the base. Someone coming back this way? Yeah, we probably better not leave the back door open here, huh? just put that back they get smart enough to get down and we hear them we'll come back and kill them all right let's proceed bunch of refrigerators and stuff in here something's probably going to jump out at us any minute you just watch going to happen, I'll bet. Right, ammo pile, I'll get that later. Okay, I'm guessing this goes up to one of those corner guard shacks. So let's not even bother uh going up there for now we don't really need to so we killed everything that was up there man 
man, this guy's tough. These are just outside zombies because they they didn't show up as red dots. Okay. Let's go ahead and lock behind us. Um, we have to make a quick retreat. <laughs> I, the good thing about this hallway, though, is that we can we can barricade ourselves if we have to. Okay, the light's going down there, so that's where it wants us to go. Let's just go around this corner and make sure it's clear, though. Okay, so it's blocked down there, and that probably goes up to the corner track. Okay, I think we're on the right track here. Um, uh, nah, let's not block that. I might regret that, but again, the other thing though is we might need to make a hasty retreat back up this direction, so. Okay. A medical pile. We go through here, it looks like. Okay, we got some. Right there. He's not feral. Just trying to be quiet here. Okay, so we got a room that going that way, and then we've got this going down into there. So I think what we should do is let's go back and clear this area first. And I'm going to, I'm just going to put a frame there, a couple frames. I'm not going to upgrade them. Shit, there's a football player right there. Might be something on the other side too, huh? Let's just make these wood. Take care of him. We got a feral cheerleader. Uh, and a normal nurse Nancy. All right, let's take care of Nancy. Keep them stun locked enough to where they can't even hit the board. There we go. All right, let's see. Is there anybody on this side? Yep, another football player. Let's let him break the board for us. Oh, that's going to take too long. All right. So far, so good. 
What in the hell? Larry the Lumberjack is here? All right. Get nut shot, Larry. You can't see your head, shoot you in the nuts. That's the rules. Oh, uh, looks like there's another Larry right there. You guys hanging out in the in the freezer, that's what you're doing, aren't you? Kneecapped. Okay. Let's get rid of this. Make sure there's nothing else in here. Okay. Good enough. Um, let's go left first. Always go left first. I'm very thankful that we have a silenced weapon. Alright, I have a feeling like we might get a rush of Zeke's from in here. So can we... Um, yeah, there we go. We'll double upgrade those and just single upgrade those. Let's also get rid of this just so we don't trigger something. Guess what I'm gonna do here is wake up the dead. Really? Nobody else in here? Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> See, yeah, there's someone like right there. What the hell, man? You didn't hear that shotgun blast. I'd actually like to not destroy these doors so I can, or, or not sh destroy them with a shotgun so I can get the hinges off of them later. Okay, so that clears this room. Presumably we're going to have another uh, restroom on this side. Okay, this time I'm just going to put frames down without upgrading. Hmm. That's suspicious. All right, well. Okay, I think there's a Zeke in there. Maybe in there. Oh shit, that scared me. Uh, we can't block the door. You know what? Doesn't matter. Let's just kill him. Whoops! He's just a normal Zeke. Okay. So we're good to go in here, and this place is cleared. Nice. Okay, next place to go is down below. I have a feeling this is going to be an ambush point. So actually, let's think about this for a second. If it is an ambush point, I guess what we can do is retreat back to here. Uh, yeah, that's what we'll do. Okay. Oh, good. It's morning. So at least we don't have to deal with outside nighttime zombies anymore. Um, 
Okay, so I just see one Zom, and he's not even running anymore. Okay. You are also just a normal Zeeker. He did? He did? He did. There is going to be so much looting to do in this place, you guys. It's going to be insane. Interact. Oh. Can we pick it up? No. We might be able to if we put a land claim block down. I know I was able to do that in Undead Legacy. Let's close that door for a second. So are we all the way down at the bottom of the silo? No, looks like there's still more. This would be a really good place to aggro a bunch of Zeeks because, you know, they wouldn't be able to get through here. Um, How tough is that? Yeah, see, that's steel. I remember seeing a greenie down here too. Yeah, see, there's a guy there. Um, I don't know if the Zombs would come to this point, though, because their AI probably doesn't show them as that, you know, that as being a pathway for them. So, oh, these are bookcases. Okay, we'll check them later. Okay, well, let's proceed. Station one through four. All right, I'm going to close that door and put a frame there. Let's go see what's got a guy over here. Looks like he's stuck. Sucks to be you, bud. Okay, let's go, um, let's go see what's on the other side of these doors first. Holy shit! Alright, we just have to wait for this to wear off. <laughs> she drugged us. Fortunately, that doesn't last too long. That's it? Alright. So this is good because we have actually two places we could retreat to. Um, can I get a frame down here? Yes, I can. Okay. All right. Let's pick this up and poke our head inside of here. Let's see what's what's going to happen. Probably something crazy. Oh, there's a lot of zombies. In oh shit! Okay, let's close that door. Um, we're going to have to close, they're going to break that door so fast. Okay. Oh my god, look how many zombies there are. That was a lot of zombies. My goodness, and there's still a bunch aggra aggravated. Whew. 
Okay, let's just wait here for a second. See, they would have just ripped through this cobblestone block if I hadn't have had explosives. I didn't even have time to set one down and upgrade it before they got through that door, you know. All right, we got another customer here. Come on through, boys. Yep, here he comes. He should... Yeah, I was going to say, he should be dying pretty soon. Okay, we have one more Zeke that's still aggravated. Is he going to come through here? Yeah, here he comes. Okay. Come here, buddy. There we go. Yeah, I am uh, very glad that we decided to bring barricades <laughs> on this mission. Because that would have been so hard for me to survive that rush of zombies. That it was a lot of Zeeks, you guys. That was a lot of Zeeks. All right, let's get our food and water back into good shape here. How much do we get for this? 42? Yeah, that's that's probably pretty... That'll get us close. That'll get us close. Okay. Let's proceed. This is fun, man. I love this PLI. It's great. What's that say? We are er, Earth... Probably Earth's last hope. I bet you that's what that means. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, we still have sleepers in here. How in the hell did they not wake up? All right, got a normal Egger. He's angry, though. Are you a normal cowboy, Bob? Yeah, you are. Surprised those guys didn't wake up. Any more sleepies in here? Nope. There's lots of lockers and bookcases for us to check later, though. Oh, boy. Okay. What are we going to have to deal with down here now? We got a janitor. And he's feral. Okay. Let's just get down to here and see if we can. Oh, yeah. All right, we got a normal Zeke that woke up there. Let's just quietly bring. Oh, does she not see us? I'm going to say, what the hell? <laughs> see another red dot right over there. Probably another sleeper down there. Yep, it's an Arlene. Just normal Arlene. Wow, lots of couches down here. We're going to have a ton of leather. There's a light right there. He, did he just disappear? He's feral. 
Oh man, nice dodge there, buddy. All right, damn it. We're gonna have to get the big gun out. Okay, I'll bet that one's gonna pop back in once we get a little closer. We could just throw a bomb on him, but let's see if we can actually lock the door. Okay. So before we check the bathrooms, let's just make sure the rest of this room is clear. We're going to get a crap ton of leather out of this place. They're all walkers. They're the kitchen crew. Okay, we got a burner and... Oh, shit. Zombie Iron Man. Oh, he's got a long reach. Okay. So he's one of those zombies that's like super armored. Even though he's got really low hit points. We got ourselves a... Strained uh, wrist here. All right, let's take one of these. And I'm going to take this to reduce the time on the sprain. Not, not by a ton, but every little bit helps, I guess, right? And uh, I think we'll wait for that health to come up naturally. Uh, since we, you know, we, we've lost some of our cap anyway. It's out into the silo. Okay, I think we've cleared this room here. Okay, let's check the bathrooms now. a lot of zombs. Oh! Shit! Ah, I didn't get it. I didn't get it done in time. Fortunately, the white derped out and stayed kneel knelt, so our bomb, our bomb got him, because he, he would have been running. A little bit slower on the attack because of our our sprained wrist i can tell oh okay <laughs> yeah that really worked well didn't it oh we'll just go up to wood on that I guess this Zombo's up here. Up in the, up in the duct work. What the hell's going on up here? Are we supposed to go this way? Maybe we are. 
feral businessman. And there's another red dot. I'm just not sure what it is. So I presume this goes back down into the other bathroom. There's an ammo thing, ammo pile there. Um, all right, I guess we're gonna drop down here and have a feral Edgar right in our face. Oh shit! Oh man, this is not good. Ah uh, shit, shit, shit. <laughs> 